Hey everybody, how's it going? Well, today we're going to talk about truck guns. Uh, if you live in the rural area, you know what a truck gun is. If you don't live in a rural area, you may not know what a truck gun is. Basically, a truck gun is a gun you throw in the truck and use it on the farm to uh, put down sick or extremely injured livestock or defend livestock against predators such as coyotes or wild dogs or rabid skunks or foxes, any, any kind of predator out there or anything that would cause a threat to your livestock. Uh, back in the day, we had trucks, we had horses, and we'd use the rifle for the same purpose, also to take down rustlers. Nowadays, I don't think we really have to worry about the rustler rustling part. You never know, though. But that's basically what a truck gun is. And I'm going to discuss a truck gun. Well, first of all, when the words truck gun are said, I think a lot of people associate the 30-30 lever action with the truck gun. I know I do, and we're going to talk about a uh, truck gun that might get overlooked. And that would be, uh, yep, it's a 30-30 lever action, but this is the Marlin 336Y, which stands for youth model. This is basically a youth model deer rifle. But to me, it makes an ideal truck gun. The difference between the two, I kind of line them up here. The butt stock on the youth is a little longer an inch shorter, but the real difference is in the barrel length. This one has a 16 and a quarter or 16 and a half, and the regular has a 20 inch. So, with that being said, back in the day, farmers used to throw the 30 30 in the gun rack on the window and drive down the road. Well, now that's illegal in certain areas, and you can no longer do that. Plus, you're advertising that you got a gun in your truck, and it's liable to get broken into and stolen. So the best thing to do is put it in a case and put it under the seat. And this 336 Youth, she fits perfectly under the seat. And it's nice and short. Uh, you can easily maneuver it, get it out of the vehicle if you need it. The difference between this and the full length is magazine capacity. The tube magazine will only hold five rounds versus six. So you can load this up with five rounds and then put a sixth one in the chamber if you want six rounds. I did a little upgrade on this one. I took off the factory sides. You can see this right here. Put in a blank plate, but the factory sides would have been here. The base would have been here, and then the actual sight would have been about right here. I put in a ghost ring, which increases my sight radius, which increases accuracy. And if you can see that, the ghost ring, you can acquire the target a lot quicker. So it just makes it faster to get on your target. So. To some people, they may see this as a youth deer rifle, but I see it as a darn good little truck gun. And I think a lot of people overlook this rifle for their, that purpose. But, uh, hey, it is what it is, so we're going to take it outside and see how she shoots. Alright, let's do it. Alright, we're going to load her up with six rounds and see what the Marlin 336Y can do. Got the safety on. Yep, got the hammer in the safe position. Gonna load her up to five rounds. Gonna chamber one round, drop the hammer back in the safe position, and top her off. Alright, let's see how fast we can spit some rounds out. Take the safety off. fast for a lever action a lot faster than a bolt rifle that's for sure so the Marlin 336Y youth gun or truck gun you decide or both let's grab some more rounds 